When I first saw the plans for the Mint Museum, it was like a light bulb came off. There aren't that many around this size. And I think Sam Francis is a great example of an artist that really did have a new vision. Look at that fabulous painting. I think that once you've worked out all of the, um, the stress points, so to speak, you know, the, the factors of how it's going to work, you just talk about what's the best way to execute that. It's all very orchestrated and we've got to think several steps ahead at all times. It is a process. It'll probably take three days to get this thing together and up on the wall. It's 19 feet tall and about 38 feet long. We've made lots of stretchers and we've you know, stretched lots of paintings, but none this large. This painting's never been seen outside of a, a, of a bank building which was located in Seattle. We've been looking at what to do with the painting, how do we make it more accessible to the public, and I can't think of a better way to do that than with the opening of the new Met Museum. The canvas is installed in the Robert Haywood Morrison Atrium. Uh, which is really the grand space of the Mint Museum. It makes your eye go upward. I mean, it really is a grand scale room, and uh, we wanted to find a painting that would really be able to stand up to that scale. And we feel that, you know, the monumental painting that Sam Francis created in 79 was perfect for this space. Sam Francis is part of the American Color School. This painting is a good example of his work in the sense of you see the white of the canvas coming through. That is something he liked to play off of. He used white as a color. He was interested in the color more than the gesture. It really takes a special wall to, to hold a painting of this size. And also this important, this is, this is a very important San Francis painting. It just feels really nice to see the painting the way it was meant to be seen, I think, from far away. It allows you to reflect on more than just the aesthetic qualities of the painting, but also you know, all the work that goes into a big project like this. And here it is.